That one just pitches middle and misses. Like it. Oh, a big nick trying to play leg side. So the keeper's going leg side, and the nick. It makes you look bad. They're price you're a keeper. It makes you look bad, but they are toughies, aren't they? They are tough. You wouldn't be able to see that at all. The tie keeper, but I'm also not really sure why they didn't, why they've taken out that slip. Just like to see it. I mean, we're only in the first over of the game. There's always going to be a little bit of movement early. Andrew Gura, one of the finds of the tournament, is met with a callous bludgeon through the covers. Yeah, again, just a little bit too much width there. McCallus able to free the arms up and hit through the unprotected offside. Had just been struggling a little bit with her timing. She was under, she was really over, over hitting the, the ball, but that's a really nice shot from her. Really waited for it. She'd been sort of really going hard at the ball, and sometimes you just got to let the ball. Some shot to finish. No chance to move a deep third. She hammered that palace into the 20s. Seven overs gone. The Tornado's 58 without loss. Fraction short. Sized it up. Saw the gap there. Gave it everything. And even though she was a little bit off balance when contact was made. Too good for deep third. Not a run out all tournament. Yeah, that's the tournament. Cut, Cut away, and that's four more. Yeah, talking of run outs, it's the tornadoes that have had nine direct hit run outs. They're the kings of that. Lucky shot there from Callis, just making a little bit of room, angling the bat, finding the gap. She knows where those gaps are. Colour strikes it down the ground, four more. She moves along to 42. She's feeling like she's got one hand on it. Just releasing the pressure here in this over. One boundary so far. Gets underneath it, hands through it, nice and straight. In the V, classic from Callis. Very good touch. And is that a chance? Susie Bates under it, yes! Another wicket. Can Falcon turn it around here? Well, it's a, it was a shot that had been sort of thrown around for a while with Steak Callis. They wanted to try and go down the ground. They put one of their better fielders down at Long On and Susie Bates. She's already taken one catch tonight, and that's her fellow country person in Sophie Devine. And now Steak Callis has fallen for the same trap again. Excellent bowling from Madison Cap. She took the pace off. The dot balls were building up. This is what exactly Falcons needed in this over of Madison Gap, a wicket, and they've got that. She played well for her 44. Sarah Callis has to walk back. Tornado's 126 for two.